says, but they left you alone on the first goal and they replaced the left Um I mean the, the first one was just the a perfect pass by the team. Um, yeah. the guy was kinda of sad beside me, but it was right on the table. Like, the second one I was just kinda of hung out Three times you guys were down by two goals. Just talk about the resiliency of this team to be able to come down like that on the road the way you guys did. Um, I mean, it's it's something you don't want to do, but it's something that we've done a lot this year is, is you know, come back and, and uh, end up winning the game. And um, You could feel it on the bench when we started coming on against shots. Something was going to happen, and once we you know got within one, I think we were pretty confident we were going to tie it, and, and that's just you know stemming from it. The leaders all the way down. What was the main feeling between the third period and the time? Um, keep playing the way we're playing at the end. Um, we saw when we sit back, you know, they, they kind of take it to us with their speed and stuff. So as long as we kept pushing, um, you know, we'd be fine. And the lift you got from Hiller, I mean, that was tremendous, wasn't it? Yeah, it, he came in and, and played awesome. And, um, it's good to see him come in and, and have a good game. Talk about this winning this series. It was a tough series, could have gone either way. Every team that won over the whole ice right, until tonight. Just to talk about how rough it was for you guys to win. Um, I mean, it's the playoffs. I mean, it was, every game was intense. And um, like you said, every game could have won either way. And, and it was just, the only way I can describe it is it's playoffs, and that's just how it goes, I guess. But um, yeah, Matt and we came out. Thanks, brother. Thank you for your